Dove Cameron, Sophia Carson and the rest of the cast aren't happy about the upcoming release of Descendants 4. They kept it very real and shared their opinions online. Many fans fell in love with Descendants because of Mal, Evie, Jay and Carlos. The director of the first three installments of Descendants, Kenny Ortega, even predicted that getting the right cast to play the villain kids would make the show a success. Which is what happened after the original cast got the roles, and the great chemistry between the cast made them consider one another as a family. According to Dove Cameron, who played Mal, the cast has closed and answered many questions fans might have about Descendants. And also, this could be why, after the third film, the usual message of, you didn't think this was the end of the story, did you, was left out. Dove said, And I think that if we can leave our, our audience with this third film feeling that we've answered all their questions, which I think in terms of script we have, mm -hmm. and if we can leave them feeling closer to themselves through us, then that's success. Then Sophia Carson, who played Evie, added how Descendants had fulfilled its part by beginning and ending with love. Boo Boo Stewart, who portrayed Jay, also described how sad he was when they were filming the last scene for Descendants 3. It wasn't even the last day of filming, but we were shooting the last scene. Mm. And I literally could not say the words. The cast members were now like a family to Boo Boo, and he couldn't imagine continuing life without them. However, the sadness of the cast with Descendants 3 ending was worsened as the unexpected happened. In 2019, while waiting for Descendants 3 to premiere, a sudden report of the passing of one of the original cast, Cameron Boyce, who played Carlos, was announced. And this was a sorrowful thing for the cast to experience, considering how close they all were. Even Dove Cameron, who doesn't like to bring up her privacy, had to come onto the internet to share her grievances as it was a lot for her to bear. I felt really weird about posting about Cameron on social media. Um, because I felt really um, emotional and uh, private. Until now, the cast still can't get over the fact that one of them is no more. But since it happened, Boo Boo mentioned they've been helping each other get over the tragic incident. So with the realization that they shot the final film of Descendants and the unexpected passing of Cameron, the original cast thought Descendants had come to an end. But later, news of a possible Descendants 4 started going around, leaving the cast confused as they didn't fully understand what that meant for them. Sophia then revealed that she would forever cherish being a part of Descendants and playing Evie, as it was her first job. I mean, for me, it was my first job. It was my first movie. So just that was so magical. Then she continued. For us, it's really hard to imagine doing anything without Cameron. So I think for us, that's where um, our heart lies. But it's, you know, it's open to so much imagination. However, even though Sophia couldn't manage doing another Descendants movie without Cameron, she felt conflicted because of the huge impact Evie has made. One of my greatest honors of my life to play Evie and to be a part of this franchise because, like you've said, we've had the privilege of touching hundreds of millions of kids. She holds Evie dearly and would have been happy to continue playing the role. According to the actress, the time she spent filming Descendants were one of the happiest moments of her life, and she's sad that the experience is forever gone with the passing of Cameron. Despite how the cast felt about the news of Descendants 4, so many fans were still asking for it. And that was when the short animated musical Descendants The Royal Wedding was released in honor of Cameron. This animation reunited the cast again, and Sathya thinks it's unique for fans who want more of Descendants. And when asked if she would do Descendants 4 in an interview in 2022, Sophia confirmed that the chapter was closed for her, as she wouldn't do anything without Cameron. However, many fans are divided over why the original cast doesn't want to be part of Descendants 4, as some say that Cameron would have been happy to see them continue the franchise. But Dove explains that the reason why Descendants 4 might not be suitable for the original cast is so much deeper than that. While speaking on Chicks in the Office podcast, Dove said, It would be really, really hard on the cast to do a film without Cameron. Um, I think that's all something where like, if there's a part of us that it would feel, I'm sure there's a part that would feel very healing and very much like we're coming home because the series was so important to us at such a pivotal point in our lives personally. Also, the actress thinks that even if Descendants 4 intends for them to heal, it would still be a complicated process and she couldn't imagine getting through that. And people have different ways of grieving, so it would be hard for them all to be on the same page again after the tragic loss of Cameron Boyce. Dove also said that it's wrong for Disney to go on with Descendants 4, knowing it could take them on a trip down memory lane that could be dangerous. But 
But since no one is exactly sure what would happen if the original cast were made to be a part of Descendants 4, Dove concluded saying, I know they want what's in all of our best interests, so we'll see. Interestingly, Dove Cameron is only against Descendants 4 because it could be a dangerous adventure for the original cast with everything that has happened. She doesn't have issues with Disney doing more Descendants. While speaking with Digital Spy in September 2019, a month after Cameron Boyce passed, Dove said, To be completely honest, as an actor who was not beholden to Disney, I would say that I think it would be smart for them to capitalize on the brand that they created. According to the actress, Disney doesn't have to follow the story with the original characters, as she even advised that they could do a spin-off, like with the new villain kids taken to Auradon for a new life. She also talked about how Disney creates universes and characters that don't have an end, as many possibilities can still be explored with Descendants. So, when Dove reacts negatively to Descendants 4, it's not because she doesn't want the franchise to continue, but because she wouldn't like to be a part of it, as it could be very traumatic. And it doesn't matter how enticing the future of Descendants is, Dove has said no to the fourth part, and is determined to let things remain that way. Aside from the popular villain kids, King Ben is another character every fan of Descendants has fallen for. And if the original cast were included in Descendants 4, viewers would have been happy to see the good-hearted young king again. Just as much as fans are in love with Ben, Mitchell Hope, who played the character, also can't get over him, as he also mentioned that he loves playing the part and wouldn't mind continuing if the chance arises. However, there's no Ben without Mal, so it doesn't matter how much Mitchell longs to be a part of Descendants 4, he can't be in it without Mal. But in future installments, Mitchell wouldn't mind playing Ben as he revealed that the character had been a good influence on him and has made him adopt a more excellent attitude. Sarah Jeffrey, who played the mean princess Audrey, said that she feels happy with how she left her character in Descendants 3, which means that she's not so keen to be in the next installment. With most of the original cast staying out of Descendants 4, one of them, China Anne McLean, who portrayed Uma will reprise her role. Unlike the main cast who find it hard to return due to Cameron's demise, China has found a way to get over that, and Cameron was her best friend before he passed. China still feels lost and hurt without Cameron, but when it comes to Descendants 4, China wants to move forward with it. While speaking about the tragic passing of Cameron, the actress said, Cameron was my first time coming into contact with demise when it came to somebody I really loved and knew closely. I didn't know how to handle it. China added that she's still dealing with the fact that she'll never see Cameron again and will always have that painful fact very close to her heart as she still misses him daily. However, the reason China can move on and continue to act in Descendants 4, knowing Cameron would no longer be a part of it, could be mainly due to her courage as a Christian. China believes Cameron is already at a place where she will join him someday. Also, the actress revealed that she still feels Cameron's presence and wouldn't like to share some of the stories as many may find it triggering. China mentioned that Cameron taught her to let go of things and move forward in the film industry no matter how terrible it gets. And his passing also taught her to focus on the things of the moment rather than getting lost in the noise set out to distract her in the industry. The actress also listens to God on what she should do and step away from, so China probably got the conviction to continue with Descendants, despite all that has happened. The original cast might have many betrayed words to say as they move away from Descendants 4, but the new cast is more than glad to be welcomed into the franchise. One of the main cast members of Descendants 4, who will play Red, Kylie Cantrell, was delighted to join the cast. She said, If someone could have told my nine-year-old self that I would one day be a part of the Descendants franchise, I would have actually lost my mind. For Kylie, it's a big deal, and she thanked her co-stars China, one of the original cast, and Dara Renee, another of the main cast, joining the franchise as Chloe, for being a part of her new experience. Although it's been an emotional journey for the original cast, they're glad that they completed the story and aren't afraid to move on. According to Dove, Disney created a safe space for them, and they will continue to appreciate that. So, what do you think of the original cast exclusion from Descendants 4 and their reactions? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and thanks for watching.